The photos make you want to cringe. The faces of opiate addiction captured in the act. Men and women overdosing behind the wheel, often with the needle still in hand. And foster agencies across the nation are saying the children of the addicts are often the unseen victims of opiate addiction. We've seen children that come into care um, for all different reasons, but there's definitely kids in there um, with experiencing abuse and neglect, and it's been connected to um, parents' use of, of drugs. Linda McCartan with Child and Family Services says the drug epidemic is greatly impacting the number of children her agency serves. Nationwide, the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services estimates more than 425,000 children are currently in foster care, the number rising steadily over the past four years. In Erie County alone, more than 1,000 children are currently in the system, with each child dealing with the adjustment in their own way. We do service children anywhere from age birth through 21. So for our real young ones, some sometimes children have been born addicted to drugs. As children get older, they have an awareness of more of what's going on. And McCartan says with an influx of children, foster agencies need qualified adults to step up as foster parents. It's very rewarding to know that we can help these kids um, be a kid. Let them be in a home where they don't have to worry about um, getting dinner every night and having to deal with adult situations. And the director at Child and Family Services says if you've ever thought about becoming a foster parent, they are holding an informational meeting in the next coming weeks. I will post that information to our website, WKBW.com, after this newscast. I'm live in the newsroom, Sierra Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News. Okay, thank you very much.